Tucked in behind the Royal BC Museum is one of the oldest buildings in British Columbia. In 1858, this little log cabin, a survivor of Victoria's days as a fur trading post, became one of the first schoolhouses in British Columbia, thanks to a small group of very determined women. The Sisters of St. Anne was a teaching order founded in Quebec in 1850. In 1858, four sisters arrived in Victoria by ship and immediately opened a school in a building at the edge of Beacon Hill Park. Soon, the sisters extended their teaching to Cowichan and Nanaimo. They later founded schools on the Lower Mainland, beginning with New Westminster and expanding to include frontier towns like Mission, Kamloops and Williams Lake. The Sisters of St. Anne also provided informal health care in many towns, eventually opening several hospitals like St. Joseph's Hospital in Victoria. A nursing school began here in 1900. The women who were trained here served in many communities across the West. Victoria was the western headquarters of the Sisters of St. Anne. In 1871, they built this convent and school modeled after religious institutions in Quebec. Major additions were completed in 1886 and 1910. The town's original Catholic cathedral, built the same year the sisters first landed in British Columbia, was hauled here on logs in 1886 and attached to the back of the convent as a chapel. The school continued to flourish over the years, but in the 1970s, with declining enrollment and increasing operational costs, the sisters sold the building and the grounds to the provincial government. The province completely renovated St. Anne's Academy in the 1990s. While most of it now contains modern offices, the parlors and chapel have been restored and turned into a museum open to the public year-round. The gardens and grounds of St. Anne's Academy still have a feeling of sanctuary, a quiet green space only steps from the center of the busy capital.